So black-footed ferrets inhabit these remote, harsh landscapes. Ferrets are actually the most endangered mammal in North America. There are only about 390 in the wild today. The black-footed ferret is a nocturnal, burrow-dwelling species. So in order to study their populations, we need to go out and look for them at night. And the traditional technique to do that is a truck-mounted spotlight. We are looking for the notorious green eye shine. The primary threat to the black-footed ferret is a non-native disease called sylvatic plague. To protect ferrets against sylvatic plague, we live trap them from their burrows. We transport them to a portable hospital trailer where we vaccinate them against this deadly disease and then we return them to the wild. While spotlighting is effective, we need to rely on line of sight to see that ferret. And we also need that ferret to be looking directly at us for us to pick up its eye shine. So in search of other solutions, which may be a little more effective, we are also testing thermal cameras mounted to towers and drones to help detect the thermal heat signature of the ferret. But the power solutions for these thermal camera systems are challenging. Traditional methods of powering these are gas-powered generators, which are noisy and they are polluting. And it also scares black-footed ferrets down into prey dog burrows, which further complicates our ability to detect and protect them from deadly diseases. So in search of sustainable power solutions, World Wildlife Fund has partnered with Jackery to use portable solar panels and generators to replace the gas generators, which enable us to power equipment necessary to find and protect the ferret. These new solutions enable us to protect this endangered species in clean and sustainable ways.